Alright, what's going on guys? It's Try was here and welcome back to an episode of Pokemon Insurgents. Um off camera I did a little bit of um training. I got my fracture I named him Fracture Bone because of Fracture. I'm probably gonna rename him. Um actually I'm gonna do that right now. And it is going to be incredibly creative and will not have any pun whatsoever. Uh <laughs> Uh, yeah, and I also got up my, uh, my Armageddon. I haven't been training Typhlosion, and I will exp Whoopsies, frick. I haven't been training my Typhlosion, and I will show you why soon. Um, but let's rename my Haxorus. Uh, yes, I would like to give it a newer name. And it will be... Hax... Ha! Ha! Funny. <clears throat> Anyways, <laughs> all right, let's go up, and I'll pull out the new Pokemon that I got. It was actually I mentioned the um, mystery gift Pokemon for the new update. Um, it was um, gosh, I hate all these Magnemites. It's just ridiculous. Um, it was C Dot, and it has a Shift Stripe, meaning that it's yeah, it's probably gonna be good. Um, I looked at the stats and compared them, and Grass is a like, not grass. Like, this Pokemon does have worse stats than Typhlosion all around. But, um, I already, all, my team, like, everything that fire is super effective against, my team can already, is already going to be super effective against it. So, I'd rather have a grass type like this. So, I've decided that I'm going to move him into my team, and I don't know what I'm going to name him yet. If you guys want to contribute, you can. That is cool, me, yo. I still have no idea what those eggs are for, and I have not even bothered testing that out yet. Um, so what I'm going to do is put on the XP share. Since it has... Let's see, it's, um, yeah, I'll switch those two items. Your shift right does not need to be there quite yet. And uh, man, Hexaurus looks awesome following you. Anyways, now we can get into the, the story once again, and we're going to be going to the library, which... Um, wow, it's lagging pretty bad right now. I'm not sure if that's come with the patch. Speaking of which, um, when I mentioned that the bugs were bad, uh, goodness gracious, huge patches have happened. Like, I think four patches have happened since the last episode I posted, so it's been pretty insane. Um, oh, frick, what? What is this crap? Hello? Welcome to the Utairo Town Library. I'm Zachary, the library. You look like a chick. The librarian here. I've made it my goal in life to instill the love and joy of reading in young kids. If you need any help, let me know. I'm sorry, but the, is the music necessary? Like, is this really necessary? Alright, we back. I'm um, sorry about that. Yeah, I can't seem to fix the... I tried to restart it just to see if I could fix the lag. Um... Not sure what that what's why that is happening. It's probably with the patch. It's a book called The Girl with the Dragonite Tattoo. That's great. So I mean each space is a different one. This book isn't very, very interesting, maybe a different one. Okay, whatever. Frick frick the, the frick frick. Okay. One hundred years of Geodude. I don't know I I have to deliver a couple of books. I'm not sure which ones they are. I'm reading up on famous users of electric type Pokemon. Super interesting. I've never heard of a Lieutenant Surge before. Alright. It's a book called An Anatomy of Doug Trio. Would you like to read it? Sure. I ain't gonna read it though. I just want to see if it, I can pick up the book or something because I don't know. It'd be a different one. Loving the time of, Char <laughs> Loving the time of Charmander. Oh my dearie. Religious Freedom and Torrin. Would you like to read it? Uh, don't read it right. It's up there. Being able to change the laws of this. Alright. I'm not finding anything in here. The grapes of Polyrath. <laughs> oh, I get the pun. I that one I get the pun. I'm sure the other ones have puns as well, but I just didn't know them. Professors of note. Many professors, scientists who study Pokemon as a profession will fade into mediocrity. However, the names of some professors have withstood the, withstood the tests of time. 
<sighs> okay, I don't need to learn about trainers. I figured it might be interesting, but... Oh, no, I don't want to read it again. I'm reading this fascinating book about ancient Torin. Apparently, it was created by a Pokemon with a thousand hands. Cool stuff, bro. It's a book called Trick Room for Dummies by London. Uh, wow, there's a lot of shells here. Oh, dear, this is a big place. The Very Hungry Caterpie. I get that one, too. That was my favorite book as a kid. The Rarest Pokeballs. Okay, yep. Why did I even click on that? I knew exactly what that was going to be about, but I still clicked on it. Alright. Great news! Okay. Why is it playing this music? The Fault in Our Star Use. Why is this freaking... Oh, this game! Oh! Oh my gosh. Arceus and Giratina. Nah, I don't know about that stuff. Spoken's a very interesting, maybe a different one. Okay. I got Swagger. It's the TM, TM87, I think. I'm not actually sure. Alright, is there anything in here? Healing in you! It's full of information and equations to do with healing moves. Thanks for that? It's a book called Who Was the First Pokemon Trainer? Would you like to read it? It was red, wasn't it? I don't need to read that crap. American Psyduck. Alright. Good night, Lunatone. I don't know some of these puns. You're not really supposed to be talking when you're in here. It's a library, after all. Shut your face. Pokemon Races. Would you like to read it? No! <laughs> I didn't even want to read it. Yeah, I think this lag that I'm getting here is to do with... Um, I think I've read, looked at every bookshelf here. Yeah, I think the lag here is to do with uh, the patch. It's not that terrible. But, I mean, I'd rather not have... Ooh, what's this? Nothing? Okay, then. Hey, statue. Human. What a beautiful view of the outside world. Simply astounding. Incredible. Wonderful. I may have been looking at too many th thesaur... Th 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 yep. Can I pick up that book? No. <laughs> I thought that was a fence to get through, but I guess not. Um, I don't even know what I'm doing in here, to be honest. The Lord of the Flygons. Guide to giving your Pokemon a better home, but definitely not a Team Rocket member. <laughs> um, Dante's Infernape. I get that one, too. The Lion, the Witch, and the War Turtle. <laughs> Torin potions cause pokerus. I'm just interested in looking at all the puns they have now. It'd be a different one. Why is this one all tied up? I'm scared, yo. I feel like one of these books are gonna be like pick up, like you could pick them up or something, but none of them have been that way. Guide to get. Why? I already saw this book. Hello? Tale of Mewtwo Cities. A tale of Two Cities. Puns. It's a book called The Old Man in the Cedra. I don't know that one. The Canter Region its Heroes. I'm not very adept at book knowledge, so... Did you know that Smeargle can learn the most moves of any Pokemon? That's because it's the only one that learns Sketch. Well, I'm learning so many new things today. I already knew that, bro. Get with the times. A Dance with the Dragonites. I feel like I know what that one is, but I'm not sure. This music is really unsettling. Like, I don't know why they're playing it. Hello? <laughs> Tales of Vestrin. Seems to be a fictional story about a young hero of the Vestrin region. What's the Vestrin region? Um, Aesop's Clefables. One flew over the Spiro's nest. I just want to look at these names, yo. Picture of Dorian Greninja. Um, Alright, looks like that's all to see here. So we'll go over to the left. I'm not even sure what I'm doing here, to be honest. It's 
search more bookshelves. Criticism of the second auger. Oh, the pages have been ripped out. That's the suspicious! Um, intro to entry hazards by Cindy. Fashion and torn. No. Lapras shrugged. New moon guide by Tobias. Looking for a book on how weather conditions affect battling. Did you know that there are conditions exclusive to the torn region? Hoping to become an expert on all of them. All right, whatever. You're not important to me. A wormple on time. Whoa, there's a lot of bookshelves here. Screw that. Wonder how they managed to make that crystal float. You know what? I'm not even gonna bother looking through all this. Those paintings on the wall, on the wall are a bit creepy. Sometimes I swear those eyes follow me around. They probably do. This library is super interesting. So much of the information is useless, but it's all so cool. I suppose that makes sense? <laughs> Alright, I guess we'll go up this ladder. The ladder that is certainly... Okay, this one is going to be searched, though. The creation of Delta Pokemon through experimentation seems to be a lot more horrific than first thought. That one's purring? Okay. Um, this book seems to be about the worship of Giratina. This book talks about the deep sea Pokemon that government have been hiding from the population. The Abyssal Call heard about this one. So is this like, this patch of the game going to be like, instead of it being Rayquaza, now it's Giratina? This book seems to revolve around the backstories of some prominent ghost type Pokemon such as Chandelure, Drifloon, and Banette. And this book is written entirely in Latin. Wonder why. Um, hello, spooky persons. Be careful with the books you find up here. Some of them contain dangerous or confidential information. of a Unovan language structure. Okay. This book is titled Dubbed Anime and Why It Isn't As Bad As You Might Think. <laughs> the one in the library truth. <laughs> dubbed anime is good. Like, I don't like subbed because I can't tell what the frick they're saying. And sometimes I don't feel like reading. Contains information on how to summon Dark Rat. Let's hope Persephone doesn't use this one. This upper floor is bizarre, but the books are just so darn interesting. This book seems to be filled with various cosmological horrors. This is probably important. Or not. What? So we're not supposed to be in here. Am I missing anything? That is a possibility. <laughs> see, what I, see what I said there? Oh, there's another doorway. Okay. Ooh, what is this? This looks suspicious. Nothing? Okay, then. There's so many bookshelves. Hey, shush, you're not supposed to talk in here. Shut up. I can do what I want! Free country, yo! I used to be a trainer before I became a librarian. Those days are long past, so you might find better use for these than I will. Ultra Balls. I guess thanks, but not. This was useless too? Oh, this looks important. It's a different color! Huh? <laughs> Lawrence of Arabia. <laughs> I don't know if you know why I'm laughing at that, but now that I think about it. No, Lawrence of Abra. Lawrence. Yep. That joke was killed. Alright, maybe I missed another pathway. Like, am I not supposed to do something in here? Maybe if I just leave, something will happen. Because I'm completely unsure as to what my objective is right here. Abandoned wing. Keep out. An aban oh, there we go. An abandoned wing. Nice fi find, Trihorse. This might just be where the prophecy is stored. I Oop. Bleh, bleh. Stuttering. <clears throat> I agree. Nobody knows the prophecy except for the leaders of the cults. It would have been that would have it would have to be hidden somewhere most people wouldn't look. Are you three going into the abandoned wing? May I ask what it what about it interests you? Oh, we were going to look for a very old book, sir. We're trainers, you see. We want to protect the region, and we figure that one that one prophecy about the cults might be back here. I see. You're so you, you'd be surprised at how many people have looked for that prophecy. Ah, Taurus. I'll let you win if you want. 
There's no prophecy back there, but there's that one glowing orb. An orb? What do you mean? That's right, it's been there since this library was built. It's only one of many of different odds and ends lying around in that wing. For whatever reason, people believe it has something to do with the prophecy. So they'll try to get it to react to them. I've already seen hundreds of people leave disappointed. Do you really want to waste your time? Well, we may as well try, right? Damien, for once in your life, you're right. Whoa, that was rude. Do you hate Damien or something? Well, you freaking jerk. Let us in, please. I promise we'll be quick. Fine, but really, we, but really, we, but we really will need to be fast. I have a lot of things to do today. All right, it's unlocked. The glowing orb is in the far end of the of the abandoned wing. I'll take you to go see it. Be careful, though. There are both wild Pokemon and possibly even trainers back there. Cause that's safe to have in the library. Let's go find out what the future holds. Why in the world would you put that in the library? <laughs> I kind of want to know what wild Pokemon are back here, though. Oh, there's train. Yeah, there is trainer. Okay, it's gonna. Uh, are ghost tights weak to fairy? I don't freaking remember. We'll find out. Worth a shot, ain't it? Who freaking cares if I die? YOLO! You shouldn't be back here. I do what I want. I do what I want, yo! Oh, by the way, um... Just want to bring this up before I forget, but, uh... I'm gonna be probably missing a lot of videos. I'm back from a vacation, but I'll be missing a lot of days for videos, most likely, because the next two weeks... Well, so soccer started, first of all, and for like the next two weeks or so... Yeah, okay, that's weak. Uh, for the next two weeks or so, I'm gonna have soccer, and it's gonna be like the, uh... Two-a-days, which is like two practices in one day, which is like most of the day is gonna be completely restricted from anything, and uh, it's gonna be a very hectic day for me. Uh, well, not a day, two weeks for me, and so I'm probably gonna miss a lot of days, but I will try to get as many as I possibly out can out um, in the time being, but I'm not going to be using Tinker Sword again. Whoa! Why did he... Why did he gain so much XP? Alright guys, we're gonna be here for a while! What the crap? Is what? What? Um... I might as well get rid of this. What? I don't understand. Why did he gain so much XP? Is this like a perk with his, uh... With him being a mystery gift? Wow, that was a lot of freaking XP! An attack that makes use of nature's power, its effects very depending on... I don't really want that. Well, okay, we're gonna be here so long, <laughs> I kid you not. There we go. Yes, I shall. I believe Hax is holding the lucky egg. I do. Some of you, one of you guys, please explain to me why the frick I gained so much XP there. I don't understand. I really don't. Um, go Dragon Claw. Dragon Claw. Let's see how much XP my C dot gains this time. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I just thought of the... Never mind. Just ignore what I just said. Why are you getting so much XP? <laughs> it's, it's fine. But... I'm so confused. Alright. This is what is the HP. The amount of HP varies with the weather. Um, we can go growth. Well, this is really easy to level them up. I will say that much. You should leave while you still can. I'm not sure what you're trying to tell me, woman. What? He's evolving. So shocked. <laughs> Doom. All right. So I just thought of a name because of Nuzleaf's. 
The, I'm actually not going to tell you guys what it is because it's pretty horrible, but I think I'm going to name him it anyways because <laughs> I'm an idiot. Uh, but yeah, I'm not going to tell you. I'm going to leave you guys in the dark. Um, Stick with using hacks. Right, what's the wild Pokemon in here? To be honest, I'm not really that interested, and he'll probably do some damage to me, so I'm just going to run the frick away, yo. So go ahead and save just in case anything goes down. Oh, I do like that Pokemon, but I'm going to pass because I think I, ha I have my team. I feel like I've got my team, you know? I like this team, and I'm proud of it. Got a uh, Litwick. I'm liking this part of the game. I don't know. Just, like the mysterious feel of it is kind of nice. I'm kind of interested in knowing like what this freaking library has that makes it it feels so mysterious. Oh my gosh, there's a Gengar in here. I mean, I want it, but I'm not gonna put it in my team. So I'm just gonna kill it because I feel like killing it. Die. Holy crap! That wasn't even a one-hit KO. You freaking stupid. Stupid, that's what it is. It doesn't have. <laughs> what? <laughs> I did that. I completely forgot what type Gengar was, and because of that, I lost my Huxelrus. Now. Um. We'll go. With Armageddon. Because. I want to evolve him. Kind of badly. I guess we'll go rock slide. <laughs> I ain't even affected by this, yo. Faint attack. Is it good? Um, we'll get rid of, uh, what's, what's Nasty Plot? Your special attack. Is he a special attack user? I'm not even sure. We'll get rid of it anyways. What's this? Is this special? It's physical. Uh. Uh. See you later. Anyways, there's no music here. This is really awkward. Okay. <laughs> Maybe it's his ability, because, like, my Pokemon that are in the front aren't gaining as much XP either. So maybe his ability has something to do with it? No? I'm not sure why I'm not gaining any XP, and I don't think that uh, Armageddon is actually going to be very good for this. So I'm going to put an Aurora instead. Take his lucky egg. Put it on you. On Aurora. Well, once Nuzleaf is at the level I want him, it'll be good anyway, so. This library is full of ancient spirits. Got a typo there. Get get to it. Gotta fix that, yo. <laughs> Gengar. Let's go Ice Beam, I guess. <coughs> Man. These next two weeks for me are just going to be so miserable because, like, I am not in the best shape because I've had mono for, like, the entire summer. And seriously, like, soccer two-a-days, I don't know if you guys have ever played high school sports like that, but soccer is the worst. And that is so much XP, but soccer is the worst when it comes to, like, the cardio stuff. And, like, I cannot do any of it because I'm out of such... I'm in such bad shape, and um, yeah, it's uh, not fun running miles and miles every day. Not fun. I keep forgetting to put on repels because I forget that the area I'm at can actually have wild Pokemon because I ain't used to that, yo. Let's put on a repel then. Anytime now. There it is. 
Anything up here worth noting? No, no, no. Alright, I have to go over here to get through the next doorway, but I kind of want to fight the trainer for XP purposes, so let's go down. And then I will fight you. That prophecy won't react to you any more than it has to anyone else. Alright. It will, though, because I am the chosen Von. Wow. I keep, they keep freezing, but then defrosting. Like, why does that happen? Do you guys know? Like... I'm not sure, like, shouldn't when you freeze, you know, stay frozen? <laughs> I'm unsure of the shenanigans going on right now. Ah, this is a good move right here. I think, unless I'm thinking differently. There we go, 90. Might as well get rid of Bullet Seed. I'm wondering, oh, this one's nice. No, no, I don't want to switch because this one is weak to ice. Um, I'm wondering what Nuzleaf is, if he's special or physical. I'll have to check that after this uh, this fight. Alright, I love watching the HP just go slowly down. Yeah, like the XP I'm gaining, I think Nuzleaf has to do with it. I think he's like taking away some of the XP. Because, like, when I was training in the cave back off camera, I got so much more than that with the Lucky Egg. That is to say, it won't react to you at all. I'm guessing there's going to be something important back there that I'm going to need to heal for. So, um, I think once I get there, what I'm going to do, it's probably close. Yeah, it's probably a good time to end the episode anyways, now that I think about it. Um, so we'll cancel that. Do I have any escape ropes? Actually, can I escape with them in the first place? I don't know where I would have them in the first place. Uh, hello? 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 Aha! I do! Screw me! That's no fun! Alright, um, well then I'm going to end off the episode and I'll see you guys back here so we can continue and see what happens when we go through the, th the thingy. So, uh, yeah, remember to hit that like button, subscribe if you guys enjoyed. Uh, remember to share me around to your friends because that helps me out a ton. And, um, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.